Good afternoon and welcome everyone to our 2021 Toowoomba Hockey Association Grand Final Day. Currently we have the A2 women between Newtown and Rangeville. I'll just read through the, the team lists. Newtown, Steph Batham, Simone Bettany, Renee Bidgood, Emma Cook, Katie Hanlon, Shani Lee, Bridie Lindemeyer, Ebony Panzeram, Sam Richards, Brianna Simmons, Zoe Skews, Jackie Tinkler, Lisa Whiteley, and Olivia Winter. And for Rangel, Jenny Anderson, Delaney Burke, Tony Cox, Melanie Goodwin, Haley Hempstead, Hempstead, Lily Kemp in the net, Jess Kibble, Layla Patterson, Isla Rickett, Shakalia Smith, Chelsea Hollist, Alison Campbell, Ava Campbell, and Tiana Beckman. As Newtown have an early shot that just goes over the back line from Sam Richards, I think. But Ranger will start off with a 16. I'll be joined shortly by Adrian Suey, North's member who's just down currently getting his winner's medallion for the North A4 men's side being victorious over Red Lions in the A4 men's final. As Newtown pull the ball out, across, just gets away from the range will play there. Backing around, Bettany goes right across to the far side. Newtown again, toil through the middle, picks up the back of the stick there from Rangeville. Shaquille Smith's back of the stick. The ball's promoted through. Newtown attacking the circle, picks up the the foot of Tony Cox for a short corner. So Newtown's first short corner of the game. So Sam Richards to inject here. Emma Cook, the captain, is on the stick trap. Simone Bettany, Shazza, on the hit. Ball comes out. Shazza gets a slap away. Sam Richards has a second dig. Another short corner. Great defence by Rangeville. Lily Kemp. Lily Kemp on the ground there, makes a good save. Gives away a short corner. Same setup, Sam Richards to inject. Cook, Bettany. Again, the ball goes left. Another slap, gets a touch across. Rickett on the ground, uh, Kemp on the ground, but Sam Richards puts a goal away. 1-0 Newtown. Newtown. Renee Bigfoot. So, a few minutes in, Newtown 1-0. Ball back to Anderson across to the help side. Range will push it forward. Turn over to Newtown. Tinkler turns the ball over. Tony Cox on the ball. Spreads it wide. Range will over the 25. Panzeram, good defence, gets the ball wide. Range will ball inside the 25. Madeline Goodwin on the ball. Goodwin to Patterson. Intercept Richards. Richards pumps it out. Picked up by Tony Cox. Cox right back to Ali Campbell. Campbell across to Kibble.
Bettany's good in defence, turns the ball over. Gets it out for a free hit. Bettany on the ball. Emma Cook, the captain, presenting. Makes some space. Good ball through. Kibble again. Works hard out. Gets a touch. Retains possession. Kibble with plenty of options. Beautiful day here in Toowoomba. Gets the ball through. Picked up by Haley Hepstead. Wins a free hit. Haley travels. Pans around, turns the ball over, gets it out to Simone. Bettany pops it through. Tory Feast, that is. Newtown retained possession. Strong ball through. Goes high from Kibble. Sam Richards on the spot, wins the free hit. Newtown shift their momentum. Hinkler gets the ball through. Strong defence by Tony Cox, but Tory gets the ball, pops it to Sm Richards. Sam Richards has a shot. Good save by Kemp. Rebounds are on offer for Shani Lee. Newtown still on the ball. Win the free hit. Richards it is. Oh, Richards rolls off. Lee on the ball. Draws a player, passes into space. Turnover by Anderson. Anderson puts... Lily Ricketts, younger sister, into space. So range for ball. Madeline Goodwin, the captain, stands over the ball, hops to go round. Back to Ali Campbell. Campbell has Kibble on the left. Gets finds Kibble. Kibble back to Campbell. Campbell turns back to Kibble. Great work in the press there from Newtown. Good tackle from the captain, Cook. Tinkler picks up Renee Bidgood. Bidgood met by Tony Cox. Strong defence. Ops to come back out to the captain, Cook. Cook has skews overlapping. Back to Lee. Back to skews. Great defence there. Layla Patterson makes the tackle. Good one now. A lot of players on the left hand side of the field as we look at it. Good one goes forward, picks up Patterson. Patterson toils, turns the ball over. Shani Lee. Just couldn't quite find Tory. Tory Thies. Kibble. Sideline hit. Finds Cox. Cox strong pass across. 50-50 Shani Lee. Turns the ball over Ali Campbell. Goodwin finds a free hit. Goodwin takes the ball quickly but Umpire wants it back on the mark. Umpire Matty Mogg down that end. Square ball to Kibble. Kibble has Sam Richards in a strong press, running forwards. Ava Campbell works hard. Range for free hit. Kibble on the ball.
kibble. As I see Richard steaming down, gets the ball away, tops it. Turn over to Newtown, strong. Strong ball out from Jackie. Jackie Tinkler, touch finder there, seven tackle reset. Beautiful, beautiful day here, like I said. Huge crowd in. We've already had some very exciting games here. As we get into our senior stuff for this afternoon, Ali Campbell, Rangel Defender on the ball. Goodwin, strong ball out, turns over, Newtown. Newtown come through on an angle. Ball into the D. Dangerous ball, play on, own player. Again, Rangeville working hard. Kibble on the ball. Good tackle from Tory Thies. Diffuses the situation. Kibble again on the ball. Tory Thies gets enough on it. Ball pops through to Shazza. Strong. Strong tackle over Camel from behind. Just deemed illegal. Cook to Panzeram. Panzeram pops a nice little ball through. Turn over to Goodwin. Goodwin back to Tory, uh, Tony Cox. Cox to Kibble. Kibble with room. Good tackle, Newtown. Step that hand out. Congratulations to the Park Fly women for winning the A4 final on shootout to Rangers. And as you just heard there, the, the past A4 women's side in a nail biting shootout against Rangeville. Just got up. Back down to the action now. Ali Campbell finds Anderson. Anderson to Kibble. Kibble, strong tackle, turns the ball over. Tory Thies gets the ball across. Olivia Winter. Winter dispossessed. Goodwin steaming forward. Has numbers on the left. Long corner, so touch by Newtown. Uh, sorry, Rangeville. No Newtown. Rangeville ball. As Kibble comes forward. Two players in the D for, New for Rangeville. Lots of defence. Kibble goes square. Coming up on, a on field two, we have the A3 men final. Red Lions first pass by. The umpires will be Joe Pansram and Tom Campbell. Anderson gets the ball right to Goodwin. Goodwin wins a free hit. Goodwin gets the ball across to Patterson. Patterson dispossessed by a good tackle from the captain. Had to be made. Goodwin long corner. Kibble calling for the ball. Gets it. Kibble drops it back. Cox. Cox back to Goodwin. Strong ball in, high ball called by umpire Morgan Lee. So Newtown defuse the situation, Newtown free hit. Through Simone Bettany. Simone over the ball, gets it across. Just out of reach there. And as I'm welcomed here by... Mr. Adrian Sui with his new bit of bling. Welcome, mate. Thanks. Congratulations. Thanks, Steve. <laughs> thanks, Dave. You're doing a good job from the sounds of it. So, yeah, thanks, well mate. Done. Yeah, it's been a nice little start here. So, Newtown has already scored through Sam Richards' rebound on a short corner. And apart from that, it's been a pretty good arm wrestle. Yep. So, how was your game? Talk us through your game. Mate, it was hot. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Very. And, yeah, good good effort. I'm injured, but anyway, that comes with old age, yeah. as you <laughs> as might I remember. <laughs> um, but, yeah, it's always always good to win. It takes the uh, 
takes a bit of the pain out of the injury, so it was good, mate. Excellent, excellent. And thanks very much for coming up. Mate. Oh, no, no, thank it's you. In, it's enjoyable to celebrate your win, but I uh, appreciate your time no. to come up and help call the, the A2 ladies game. No, any time. It's cooler up here too. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> so Newtown now through Abby Panzeram is going to take a 16-yard hit. Across to Jackie Tinkler. Gets a nice strong ball through. Ali Campbell for Rangeville picks it up. Campbell punches it out to the right. Just a mistrap by Goodwin. Nice and composed there by Newtown. They've got some pretty good, solid old hockey heads out there. Um, <clears throat> nice and calm. Yeah, so absolutely. It it's a good mix. It's always a good mix, A2, or second division of the young up and comers and, and sometimes the more experienced players who are coming back down. Yep. So, and as we say that, what a big good three. Another shot there. Clearance and a short corner. So, Lily Kemp, strong again. Dominant, dominant uh, clearance, but short corner first. So, Newtown again. This is their third short corner, I think. Inside the last minute of the first quarter. And the uh, A4 women must have just finished a nail biter up there, mate, in shootouts. Yes, I'm um, not sure who got the results, Steve. The past uh, girls, girls had the win. Yeah. Yeah. win so, um, pretty nerve wracking result for them, but good outcome and good effort if they got that result. I wonder if the A4 women practice shootouts at training. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think uh, most grand final teams this week, I think, do practice a bit of shootouts, Steve, so. So ball Torres. comes left. Trapping a shot. Oh, Camp free. out. Back stick Second shot, shot again as a shot. Across the face. Yeah, a little bit wide. So 10 seconds now. Yeah. Will they be quick enough? Just a bit of free ball there. Um, <clears throat> on that second shot, that rebound. Um, but yes, end of first quarter. Very good. So Newtown come off the field in the first corner. Get some instructions by umpire, uh, by Coach Moo, and uh, one nil in front. So we'll see you in a minute. <laughs> And we're back. So second quarter now. Newtown up to go forward through Tory Thies. Yes. Beach one, beach two. Oh, oh up off well the stick of Tony Cox straight into a mouth. So Tory Thies has hit the ground straight away. Probably a bit of shock for a start, but yeah. she gets up and runs off, so she seems to be all right, mate. Yeah, I think it was shock, Steve. She's yeah, bounced up pretty quickly, so um, thankfully there's not too much uh, velocity on that ball, yeah, which probably yeah. helps. So, but yep. still, a ball into the mouth's not a no. That's right. Not, not nice. Looks like she's wearing a mouth guard, thankfully. So, yeah. so Goodwin's Goodwin. been good now. Yeah, yeah she's no. been solid at the back right there. Sam Richards mm -hmm. overcomes her and gets the ball. <coughs> so. 
So Katie Hanlon gets us off. Intercept by Campbell. Well read. Yeah, Emma Cook. Just runs over yeah, the top of it. Cook. Nice and patient. Tori Thies on the top there here. She is. Gets a shot away. Not a very and strong one, but it was going towards the net. And the rebounds cause a short corner. As Tori Thies is just checking, getting Sam Richards to check her mouth to see what it looks like. But she's still out there, so nice and tough. Yeah, Lily Kemp is um, pretty good in that goal, Steve. She's yeah, um, a nice, good, upcoming goalkeeper. Um, yeah, it's, if Newtown are going to score, they're going to have to do well to get around her. Yeah, exactly right. So Richards to Cook. Simone left, goes to left again. Yep, layoff. Back Cook, to in and oh, out. Back to Cook. Can't quite. Yeah, Jackie Tinkler just couldn't quite get a shot away there. Yeah, I think it got a bit surpri it surprised me a bit. They had a bit more time there than what I think they, they thought they had. Yeah. But uh, good effort by the Rangeville yeah. to get that out of the D. A good recovery. Cook and Campbell. Oh, no, yep. Cook and Jenny Anderson. Jenny Anderson. Jenny Anderson. And it's a good ball. Gets the ball away. Looks like Haley. Yeah, Haley Hempstead. Hempstead, Bentley. Toil away. Shaquillia Smith there, doing some yards on the ball now. It's a bit loose here, we just need someone to Smith, get control. Smith to Campbell, oh. wins a free hit over Campbell. Brother Tom Campbell just made just one play of the match in the J-Boys game in a losing team to, to the past high boys. So another cracking game here today at Toowoomba Hockey, the J-Boys game. Kibble on the ball. Yeah, they're set up here well. Options to go around. Yeah, that's a good ball left. Straight Maddie across Goodwin the Goodwin. A bit of space out there, so Maddie's got a bit of time here. Richard's doing a lot of running. Does it really well. Puts pressure on the free on the hit. It's play on though. Not being dangerous. Anderson one-time slap into the D. A couple of balls no touches in the air there. there. But clearly, umpire's not thinking they're dangerous at all. Bettany again on the ball. Newtown 16. 1-0 one, one the score through Sam Richards in the first quarter. Ball comes out. Tony Cox slaps it back. It looks like young Isla Rickett out yeah. there. Lily's little sister. A nice run around the baseline. Good strength. Yeah, she did well there. Three hit. Looks like Delaney Burke. Maddie Goodwin. Just can't quite get that ball into the D, but she's recovered well. Good win again. Relieves the pressure back to Cox. Richards again doing great yards. Good win. Jenny Anderson wins the free hit. Showing some experience there. Yeah, Rangel just need to hold, a, hold the ball here a bit. Just create a few opportunities, build a bit more pressure. They've had to defend for a while. But they're going all right here, holding possession back yeah. to Tony Cox. Richards good press again. Anderson mistrap bobbles away though. Uh, just a, a look like a lack of communication by those Rangeville strikers, but anyway, they've got it back here with Haley Hempstead. It's a good penetrating run. But probably even better tackle there by oh. Renee Biggood. Strong hit out. Allowed to play on, chipped over the top. But got away with it, 16. Yeah, did well then, Newtown just to defuse a pretty uh, ominous attacking opportunity there by Rangel. So Rangel hasn't had a short corner yet, so. It probably speaks volumes for the, the new town defence. Panzer and Bettany. Great ball, Campbell. Straight across to uh, good, Goodwin. Goodwin just gets a touch there from the Newtown player and puts it out. Yeah, it looks like the uh, the heat's taken a little bit of a toll out here at the moment. You mentioned before, Steve, Sam Richards has uh, been doing quite a bit of work on that press yeah. and uh, starting to slow down a little bit, which is understandable given how warm it is up here today. Yeah, absolutely. Reset on the side on hit, hit yep. here with Matty Goodwin. Goodwin uses Anderson, Anderson yep, back. back to Cox. We can get this left transfer going here to just keep just a bit of a tough, unfortunate loose tough pass challenge there. there. Tony Cox won't be happy with that. She's quite the perfectionist. Tony Cox has been a high level player for a long time. 
Thies on the ball. Yeah, nice strong player on the ball here, Tori. Newtown opportunity moving forward. A good contest there, Renee Bigood. She's won that out of Alec Campbell. Bigood into the shot. D. Oh, and a deflection. deflection off her own player. And swing and miss there by Sam. But yeah. Again, Lily Kemp um, showing all the skills down, yeah. down there. Being, oh. Perfect positioning, yeah, wasn't it? absolutely. And Sam Richards, the eyes lit up there. Yeah. Just went over yeah. the top of the ball. <laughs> It's a great ball there, Shaquille Smith. Just receiving that. Yeah, from just lost Alan a little bit Campbell. of control there, unfortunately, but oh, umpire Matty Mogg just following him back. Take that free hit on the mark. Tinkler again. Oh, a lot of space there Picks for Corey. Up no, just lost possession. Ali Campbell, though, nice and safe back there. A bit lazy from Burke there, I thought. We could have got around that and trapped it first time. Yeah, Newtown just pulling back a bit of control of the game here again now. Rangel had the run for about five minutes of this um, second quarter, but Newtown got the ascendancy back again here now. The experienced head starting to take a bit of control again. But as we speak, though... Good ball across. So welcome to everyone who's tuning in on our Facebook live stream. Welcome to a uh, beautiful day here at Toowoomba Hockey Association, the A2 Women's Final. So we're in the second quarter of this game now. 1-0 the score to Newtown through a Sam Richards goal. Yeah, Sabone Bettany just holding that ball up in the midfield here. Renee Bidgood, yeah, it's a pretty good contest yeah. between her and Tony Cox so far through the game. Good passing there from Newtown too. Yeah, finding a bit of space and time there. McCook just throws the ball straight into the D there. Bidgood couldn't quite get a touch on it. Although Bidgood likes to dis would like to disagree, but yeah, and just I'm sure they're nice and respectfully asking you yeah, know, yeah. Mob there just for clarification on that call. Absolutely. Campbell goes to Goodwin, who's been help very helpful oh, for Sam Campbell. Richards has got that, and she's chance here. She's penetrating. Oh, good recovery there, Tony. Just have to spot. Yeah. Well done. Good game awareness there from Tony Cox. Yeah, knew exactly good, where to stand. Yeah, good hockey all around. Knew yeah. the keeper would cover the right, so she covered the left and received the ball. Bentney now on a run. Each one beats a couple. Yeah, she's been busy, Simone. Gets a touch from Jenny Anderson, so Newtown ball. Just looking for an option here, not too much movement from Newtown. She injects the ball over the 25, picks up the foot of Goodwin, but play on. Shani Lee just loses control. Goodwin again. Crunches the ball out. A little bit of pressure, just a loose pass there by Simone. Chelsea Hollis on the ball now. Yeah, Chelsea Hollis. One of the little young guns from Rangeville. Just holding that ball up. Chelsea, but done well. Good work. Yep. Back to Burke. Okay. Uh, back to Patterson. Yep, Layla Patterson. Just a deflection there. Gets the free hit. Jess Kibble stepping up with his free hit. Livia Winter back onto the field now. Just a on miss the ball. hit there, Jess. It was a good pass, but... Winner to Cook. Cook finds looks the like, left wing. Yeah, it looks like Brianna Simmons out there and Livia Winter. She's Winter's gonna, yeah, running she's, fast. Yeah. Just, I thought she probably could have made that a 50-50 there, but yeah. didn't quite reach out. The experience at Ali Campbell turns the ball over. Ebony Pandram. Yeah, just eliminating two attackers there just to find that extra bit of space. And now Tori's just limit, you know, find some space in the midfield and she's got some great speed. Still got it, Tori. Crosses the ball in. Yeah, Campbell. Alan Campbell, well read. Nice and safe. Right just on that line. Option here. Not quite finding those passes and at the moment, Rangel, unfortunately. Yeah, quite a good tackle there from, from Jack. And doing plenty of work. Yeah, great recovery. That's great effort. Delaney Burke now uses Kibble. Kibble, good passing. Short, uh, Hempstead. He's got Hempstead, some space here. If she yeah. get that ball down into ball top. Opens up. Panzeram, strong tackle. Yeah. Panzeram. Just yeah, one step too far there, I think. Yeah, she that early. Hollis, Hollis took off, so yeah. she probably could have just slotted that ball through. But Panzeram equal to the task. 
Yeah, a bit of grand final pressure, I think, Steve. Yeah, today's the day it happens. That's for sure. We've got Jess Kibble on the ball, just trying to find an option. Not too much movement there by Rangeville. Probably like that option again, Kibble, I would say. And Ebony, in <laughs> saying that, I think <laughs> Ebony probably wants that one back too. Here we go. Jess Kibble on the ball. Good contest here. Inside. Just turns and spins on Tory there, yeah. wins a free hit. Good defence, yeah. Tory Thies. Yeah, back in there, Jess. Whoa, <laughs> strong chip over the top there. Yeah, we've probably seen a couple of those uh, <laughs> not be uh, awarded so far in the match, but anyway, that's all right. I think the, both teams will be enjoying and looking at uh, just a couple of seconds rest here at the minute. Yeah. Good duck from the captain, yeah. Cook, nearly took yeah, head off. definitely. <laughs> Some of the guys starting to lean on the stick, so the, uh, we've been talking about the weather. I think they're, they're starting to feel it a bit more yeah, now. 26 or 27 degrees here at the moment, so... Yep, we've still got about six minutes to go in this second quarter. Jess Kibble on the ball. Hopefully it starts to cool off soon. Great ball, oh, great lead. Ball. Chelsea, Chelsea Hollis. Hollis just couldn't go she's got that back. What can we do here, Chelsea? Get short <laughs> foot there. No, not quite. No, play just on. been a stick deflection. Unlucky, but great effort, great lead. Chelsea Hollis. Thies. As a left winger on the outside. Brighty, Brighty over the 25. Yep. Trying to find Gets the ball back in. Good in touch. There. Oh, oh, just missed. Good work. Some good hockey all Tory around Tory Thies has a shot, but it just it takes a deflection off Lily Kemp, the keeper, over the baseline. So long corner. Five to go, first half. Yeah, Renee Big good up on the ball. She's got a little bit of room in front of her here at the moment. It's got Simone Bettany on the outside here. He's penetrating Simone. Just, Just gets away from the shazza. <laughs> <laughs> she won't be happy about that. She runs back with a little grin yeah, on her face. Yeah, great second. Then. Great got a bit effort. of work to do, Bettany Bet Bet now. She's the defender right up at the yeah, baseline. She's working real hard. Back. But, oh, looks like Katie Hanlon there. It's nice and yeah, safe. And then we've got good some experience. Good yeah. Bid good. Loose pass. Bid good oh, wins it back. Strong bid good. Just holding it up here now in Newtown. Yeah, good game management out here now by these uh, experienced heads in this Newtown A2 team. Just runs over the sideline. Steph Batterham on the ball, or yep. runs off for Thies. Thies just outside the 25, can go straight in if she wants and does. Got a ball in the air, Alison Campbell. Campbell yeah, good defuses clearance. the situation. We've got some space now, Delaney Burke. Burke with speed. But great efforts here by yeah. Newtown to get back around this around the ball, making right it a lot harder. Ball. Great back tackling and still going. Yeah, and McCall putting lots of pressure on. Which was probably lucky to get away with that. But as we speak, three oh. just outside. I thought Morgan might have let the advantage go there. But anyway, we pulled up just outside the D. Jenny Anderson coming off for a spell. Ava Campbell on. Oh, oh just a missed trap there. Yeah. By, it looks like that might be Tia Beckman. That's exactly who it is, Tia Beckman. So Newtown ball now. Yeah, substitution's been made thick and fast around here at the moment. Lisa Whiteley on the ball. Understandable. Yeah, Movement's not good, quite there. But. Big good coming off for a spell straight with the ice bag on the back of the neck. Cool the, cool the body temperature. Yeah, definitely a bit of a change of pace to the A2 guys who usually play half past five, six o'clock on a Saturday night. Yeah, exactly right. Yeah, Lisa Whiteley back on the ball. Emma Cook. Nice strong tackle there, Delaney Burke. Yeah, Burke was good. Winner losing control. Hempstead on the ball. Nice play there by Newtown. Just slowing down, slowing it down, giving their defence time to reset. Just a loose pass. Rangel just not quite finding going stick to stick here at the minute. Two minutes to go, second quarter. And Newtown's still up after going, scoring their first goal very early in the game. Lisa Whiteley on the ball. Nice strong clearance. Or is it too bright? Yeah. Ailey Hempstead. Nice penetration down the baseline. And oh, strong tackle. Do. Great tackle. 
Well, no, we got a short corner. And I think that was good communication from the two umpires there who yeah. are mic'd up for the game, or they've been mic'd up all weekend, all day. Yeah, nice strong corner there. So, giving a thumbs up to each other, the umpires. So, good communication. And this might be first short corner, Steve, is it? For first Rangeville short for the corner game? for Rangeville. So, as you see, Ali Campbell's come up. Tony Cox has come up. Yeah, we'll so, see. a couple we'll of the experienced heads. Yeah, we'll see what Rangeville can offer here on their first short corner. So, a minute and a half to play. Just waiting for Newtown to sort out face masks. The first chance, I think, it's Zoe Scoo's in goal. So, we'll just see how Newtown's defence sets up on this defensive short corner. So, Rangeville to inject. Goes left to Ali Campbell. Ali Campbell pops it right. All right, Chelsea Hollis on the ball. Still on it. And... Not quite, but good clearance there. Good defence, Newtown. Probably just not quite the aggression um, in the D from Rangel just there. I think they had a little bit of time in there to get a at least get a shot yeah, away on goal. Right. Yep. Handlin now. Try and hopefully run down the clock. We've got about yeah, 30, 30 seconds, seconds left in the quarter. Just Kibble on the ball. Defense, yeah, Jenny Anderson in the middle. So inside the last 20 seconds, mate, a bit mate. of a recap of that quarter. What are your thoughts? Yeah, look, I still think Rangeville, I think, to expected. They've had probably quite a bit of this team playing the J1 grand final so far today. So um, understandable, they might be getting a little bit tired. But I just think the experience of Newtown at the moment, their game management's looking pretty good. You know, they're pushing when they need to. They're holding up. Their, I think their game management's um, pretty good here at the moment, yep. which I think is, I, from my end, Steve, I think that's the difference here at the minute. Yeah, and as both teams come off now at okay, half time for a break, we'll be back in a couple of minutes. Um, it was an interesting start to the game. I think we struggled at the start. Red Lions came out really hard. Um, I think after the first quarter, we gained um, some composure, but it was definitely a hard fought game. Yeah, definitely. After the start of the season we had, I think realistically, we were just happy to make the top four. Um, and we're really excited and proud of ourselves for making it this far. Yeah, definitely. I think, to be realistic, I think we were really um, struggling and I think that especially the young ones really stepped up midway through the season and yeah, we definitely um, have been working hard the last few weeks and the last couple of months and really excited to be um, in the big grand final on the weekend. Um, definitely, I think we had a few, few injuries at the start of the season. Um, we were lucky enough to get some of our Brisbane players to be able to come up and play through the season. But I definitely, I think our spine for us has um, held us together and hopefully we'll do the same on the weekend. Um, definitely, we know who the, their key players are. Um, definitely through their spine as well again. Um, and hopefully we can counteract them and Get, stick to our game plan and hopefully we can shut them down and get the win. Um, yeah, I'm excited that we made it. I don't think we really got the credit that we deserve um, from the season we had. Like, yes, we had injuries and we had a couple of off games, but I think we've really proven ourselves over the last few weeks and we definitely deserve to be there, so I'm really thrilled that we made it. Um, I'm so proud of them, especially the young ones. Like, we have a lot of rookies this year. It's their first year actually registered in A grade and they've really stepped up. They've really um, yeah, filled in for where we needed them in the midfield, especially especially when we had a few rough games and yeah, happy with them and how we were playing together. It was tough because it was just really on and off. Like we couldn't really get on a roll. We were kind of yeah, we had a full team, and then the next month there was like four players out that we needed each week, and um, it was just a really disjointed season. And I think that um, got us a bit, but we've like collected ourselves together now, so we're back and back in our good books for our club and for our coach.
Oh, we just need to play good hockey, which is we're building up to a really good game. I feel like this weekend is going to be one of our best games, especially against Pass Thai. We always seem to play well against them because they're also a very strong team. Um, so we'll keep our composure, stay strong and trust each other. Oh, look, they have got a very strong midfield um, and their backs as well are quite strong as well. So going wide or over is going to be our plan of attack. Very exciting. Always exciting to play in a grand final. You don't get many, if any. Um, overall, it's a fairly comfortable game. Yeah. Um, basically, I, I don't think we need to change anything. Um, we play quite a good structure. Um, if we keep the momentum and the movement going as we always do all year, um, I don't think we need to do anything other than execute our game to the best of our ability and um, just reduce errors. So we want to increase our positive outcomes all over the field. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, we're lucky to have strength all over the field. Um, it's really good when we do get down the edges, um, but then you've got someone of Erin uh, McKelly's calibre down the centre, and she's just amazing to watch when she just carves up down the middle. So it's one or the other. <laughs> um, oh, absolutely, yeah, but um, we've got Jamie. <laughs>
Good defence, Tony Cox. Isla Rickett on the ball. <laughs> Bentley cleans up. Good second effort, Isla. Probably just needed to be a little bit stronger on that carry, but as we see, M. Cook, nice strong tussle there, and just use a, use of a bit of body there. Bit of body. Umpire Mog green card. So two minutes for Haley Hempstead. We'll just see what uh, Newtown can do now with uh, with one extra player. Jess Kibble, nice interception. Just couldn't quite maintain control there, Jess. And it'd be remiss of us not to mention uh, our regional hockey and coaching manager, Mr. Matt Cook's birthday today, 28 today. So. Happy yeah. birthday, Cookie. Yeah, doing a fantastic job here for Toowoomba Hockey. And... Yes, but, uh, I'm sure there's no better place he'd rather be today on his birthday, oh, Cookie. So. Surrounded by hockey, hockey yeah, players. Loving he loves it. I'm yeah. sure he's had about a thousand birthday uh, well wishes to, throughout <laughs> the day. But yeah, doing a great job, Cookie. We're just back to the action here. Newtown just holding that possession, not rushing it. Using space out here, Tory Thies. If we can link up here, or oh, just a just loose back behind, yeah. but Emma Cook still there, pushing forward through the midfield. Oh, Sam Richards. Richards, good reach, good recovery. Pounces on the ball, gets it across. Outcome. Who's Ali, there? Ali Campbell. Ali Campbell. <laughs> <laughs> can read a game of hockey, Ali Campbell. Yeah, she's been real safe back there for Rangeville. Setting up here, Katie Hanlon. Back to Ebony Pansram, just taking their time, Newtown. We mentioned before, game management, and good indication of, uh, of that for Newtown. Maddie Goodwin clearing that. Direct ball straight in, Goodwin good enough, gets the ball oh, out. Gets a long, get a long corner out of that. Just can't quite see he's on the ball Tinkler though there, Steve. Tinkler, Jackie Tinkler. Yep. A lot of space in front. Yeah, Kibble comes out. Kibble put a bit of pressure. Diffuses that. As we Hempstead says, back Hempstead on. back on after two minutes. And Cook just holding it up here again. Nice little jink pass there from Cook. Just back into the traffic there, Hanlon. Oh, we've just got another. Oh, and just as we speak, red lines. First goal in the A3 men's yeah. final. Jenny Anderson on the ball. I see Just a THA board member, Mr. Scotty Nichols, running back with his hand in the air. So yeah, maybe he was the goal scorer, yeah, could have been Scotty. Scotty Nichols. <laughs> yeah, he could have been fist pumping. Not sure how many goals the, uh, the big fella gets up there these days, but clearly happy. Intercept here now from yeah, Newtown. Yeah, Smith, and yeah, she gets the result. Just see what Rangel can do here now. They haven't probably have as many attacking opportunities, but Jenny Anderson on the ball. Great clearance out of Jess Kibble. Just Kibble over the back line, so seven line. tackle reset there. <laughs> Bettany strolls forward. Yeah, right to Tinkler. Yes. Tinkler, a little bump, bouncy ball over through Cox. Tory Feast. Yeah, but Fox to Campbell. Campbell. Yeah, we've got a deflection, we've got a good result. We've got these young Rangeville girls, Hempstead. So that'll be couldn't a Rangeville ball. Yeah, couldn't quite keep that one in. He yeah, came off Tory Thies that ball, so Rangeville, good attacking position now. So Rangeville work to do, 1 0 down. Just going through the net there, looks like Layla Patterson on the ball. Let's see what Layla can do down here. Nice ball Gets back through. to Cox. Bit of time here now for Tony. Cox, but unfortunately, straight yeah, to Feast and direct got shot some, there, yeah, a bit pass. of space here now with Newtown. Miranda <coughs> Simmons just couldn't quite get that first touch, and Maddie Goodwin, good result. Yeah, Goodwin's been good all game. Nice and steady, doing a job well, throwing some quality passes. Again, Jenny Anderson picks up good experience there from Anderson, reaches out, picks up the foot, foot a bit good. good. Anderson picks up 
Yeah, so Bo Bettany in there, but Renee Bigwood bit of time again in the midfield. But Rangel have recovered well defensively, got players back behind the ball. Nice. Yeah, good work. Jess Kibble over there. Playing strongly at that left half. Just these, Delaney Burke just onto her foot. Cook in the midfield. Under pressure, beats the two of them, throws it back to Jackie Tinkler. Gets a touch from Kibble over the baseline, long corner. Yeah, doing well over there, Jess. Kibble, a lot of ball, a lot of action going into that left corner. Just getting their stick in there, just holding up the play. Tinkler again, travels, travels. Great tackle, Tony Cox. Tony just Cox. Right for it. Yeah, yeah well done. obstruction. Yeah. It's like she knew what was happening. The moment uh, Tinkler got that ball then, Steve, so she was yeah. all over it, Tony Cox. So Kib Kibble and Cox both over the ball. So travel forward. Sam Richards now races out. Gets a touch from Richards. It's over the sideline. He coach Ross. Some nice coaching from the uh, dugout down here. Again, Kibble has options. Cox slowing things right down. Picks up Delaney Burke. Uh, Tori Thies in there. Good pressure there from Sam Richards. Forces a turnover. Yeah, Rangel just unfortunately just can't get that ball out of that pocket on that far left side. Oh, dangerous ball there. Yeah, Chelsea Hollis cuts it Top off. race now. Bentley with speed. Does enough. Some skill. Finds pans are in. Picks up Tinkler. Tinkler oh, works okay. hard, gets the ball back, wins a free hit. Panzeram strolls up, punches the ball forward. Oh, oh straight through trash. Kibble. <laughs> Mousetrap play. Good thinking from Kibble. Wins the ball back. <laughs> yeah, can't blame Jess there. She's been quite involved in this yeah, third quarter. Yeah, she's had a great game. Her and, and Goodwin, both the outside halves, play very well. Campbell on the ball. Nice and easy. Good clearance out. Again, Tinkler wins a free hit. Yeah, and you've just shown that little bit extra urgency here now. The first to the ball. Oh, Jenny Anderson. Oh, we, and we got yeah, Ava well Campbell Anderson. on the ball. Oh, just didn't quite Hold reach out, up. Campbell. Like a nice little flashy new stick there for Ava Campbell. Lisa Whiteley does well. Cook travels, throws Cox. the ball forward. Loose in there, but good, good. just missed traps that. And the other Tony Cam Cox did enough. The other Campbell, like she's been so far through the game. Nice and solid in the day. Cook, Cook on the ball. Yeah, long corner. Options here for Newtown. Be good. Oh, be yeah, good. Sure. Great drag. Picks up a foot of Tony Cox just inside the D. Short corner. Tony Cox was low, but just got under a stick before she put her knuckle on the ground. So short corner for Red, uh, Newtown. <coughs> Lily Kemp, the keeper for Range, we're just holding back and making sure the players are set. Richards to inject. Cook and Bentney as per normal. Be good backing up. Set. Richards. Nice ball by Richards. To the trap. Simone with the slap. slap. And raised yeah. ball. Yep. Raised ball from Goodwin. <laughs> Some instructions coming out from Coach Ross. Wants the ball going at the net hard. Just like she would, mate. Richards setting up again.
Let's see what the variation. Simone's hit. And oh, it's Kemp. great save and great work great on the post. But from Newtown Kemp. got the ball back. Oh, again, a glove Instead, save. And we've got another short corner. Great reflexes, Lily Kemp. So a couple of shots there. Saves them both. Newtown look like they've got the same setup again. Rangewood defence doing well. Three and a half to go in the third. And just as we speak, red lines red go lines up 2-0 yeah. up on field two in the A3 men's final. And they call the third quarter the championship quarter. Richards out. Nice quick inject that time. Layoff. Right. Tory the shot. Gets a shot away. Great save by Lily Kemp, Kemp again. again. Outstanding from Kemp. Really keeping Rangel in the game here. Yeah, and starting to make Newtown think about how they're going to get a ball past her. She's been fantastic in this goal. Afternoon to all our viewers. Tell us what you think. Richards again. We'll just see what Newtown offer in this attacking short corner. Uh, Bettany. Shot. Oh. oh. Again, just wide. Yeah. But Hit that Kemp's, pretty cleanly, yeah, Simone. Kemp's stick was on the ground there. Tony Cox just bringing that, bring that ball out to Jenny Anderson. Ava Campbell, self in the contest here. Yeah, great work, Jenny. Anderson to Campbell. Yeah, good work, Ava. Not quite finding the stick of one of her teammates, but... We, back to be good. Pressure by Chelsea Tinkler, Hollis. Turnover. Hollis. Travelling forward into the D can now. We can we do? Turns, gets the ball across. And they've got the short corner. Panzeram, hands in the air, not sure what happened there, but a short corner. Again, I think there was some nice uh, polite asking of clarification on the call. Oh, here's Cookie. G'day, Steve. G'day, Cookie, how are you, mate? Snuck G'day. up in oh, here. Oh, and Rangeville Royalty <laughs> as well. <laughs> How's your day going, mate? There's been lots of people commenting on the Facebook about your birthday. Happy birthday, uh, mate. Thanks, Steve. Yeah, it's good to be here. It's been a crappy day. Couldn't ask for better better weather and um, some fantastic hockey today. So so you've been sitting there watching. What are your thoughts on the game, mate? Well, I've only just popped up, but it uh, looks like a bit of an arm wrestle. Newtown obviously having a fair few penalty corners, but the youth of, of Rangeville has caught him on the counter-attack here. So we've got Jenny Anderson injecting here, Tony Cox, Alison Campbell... Nice stop and, and a oh, good strong. save by Zoe Skews. Yeah, good work from yeah. Skews. That's a great short corner hit from Campbell. Yeah, plenty of power. And we talk about the youth of range. We talked about Jenny Anderson, Tony Cox and Ali Campbell straight away. <laughs> yeah, oh, look, we've got a couple of great young goalkeepers out here in this game though as well. Zoe Skews yeah, from Newtown as well. Been exceptional. Round two, I think they played each other in the J1s final. So, they did too, oh, yeah. Cookie. Yeah. They yeah. again a few hours later. Yeah, and so far, I think, yeah, it's, we're, we're one all. Working well. Taking a quick free hit. And wants Got to get space. the job done. Oh, couldn't quite get control there. Looks like Brandon Simmons out there. Picks up the foot of Simmons. Kibble to Burke. Kibble's, nice link up. Kibble's been good again, tooling away. Back to Kibble. Great effort there by Tory Thies. Still making it a bit hard to Grangel to try and get this ball through, particularly through the midfield. Now we're just playing a bit of Forcer back now. <laughs> Feast to Cox, oh, back to Feast. Yeah, good strong effort there, Delaney Burke. Yeah, Chelsea Burke, Hollis, she's been, Chelsea's been good. good reach. Uh, just running out of time. Three quarter time course. beats them. So as we go now to three quarter time, I'm going to sign looming for Rangel. I need work to do. 1 0 to Newtown. See you back after this.
Welcome back. Third to th uh, fourth and final quarter here on field one. Newtown still up 1 0. They've had the one goal advantage for the best part of the game so far. So if anyone doesn't know these clubs, we've got on the screen it'll be Rangeville running left to right and Newtown obviously right to left. So three quarter time, Adrian, and 1 0 score to Newtown. What are your thoughts on? Who breaks this game open now in the last quarter? Yeah, still stand by Steve, the uh, the, the experienced heads in this Newtown team. I think uh, Tory Thies is stepping up. Renee Bidgood, I think, has been really strong. Um, always As going speak, to speak. Yeah. And advantage play by no, another short corner. Yeah. But guess what we set up? Yeah, I think uh, yeah, Renee Bidgood's been quite potent at the top of the circle. She's just finding space and close in skills. So we, uh, yeah, so I'll, I'll put money on Tory, I think. If yeah, okay. we get another goal, yep. we'll go on Tory. But yeah, right, yeah. Right. So Newtown now, this is probably oh, seven or eighth short corner for them in the game. Yep. Uh, I think they've only scored one off. Well, they've only scored one off a short corner early on. Yeah, and Rangel's defence has been pretty good. I haven't troubled them too much, but maybe famous last words from me. The commentator. The commentator scores. Yeah, goes. <laughs> is it Simone Bettany? Does that work in A2 women's hockey? The commentator uh, scores? Oh. oh. <laughs> It <laughs> nearly did, but uh, Goodwin, good clearance. Good, yeah, yeah. Matty Goodwin's been strong. And for the Rangel, the Rangel need to score two. Yes. What are your thoughts for the Rangel side, mate? Uh, look, we've got Hayley Hempstead up front here. Um, I think, yeah, it's clearly going to come down to a couple of these younger strikers, I think, for, for Rangel. Um, but Newtown's defence, though, is making it quite hard for them to get nice, clean ball um, through to them. So, yeah. I don't know, yeah. Bit of an arm wrestle here, Steve. So we'll just see what happens. But as we speak, just a couple of these Rangel young guns, you know, are on the ball now. But great tackle there by Wood. Yeah, Wood and Burke come together. Kibble now. Outside the 25, so the ball can go straight into the D from there. And she's looking for a Jess and gets it in. And there's a touch. Oh, I thought. Looked like a touch, didn't it? Yeah, she didn't celebrate like that. No, was there was touch. no celebration down there, so I think that was a giveaway. That Some of these older heads from range will need to teach these young girls a thing or two. Yeah, throw your stick in the air. <laughs> Bettany now. Simone's boyfriend's birthday today too, Matt Cook. Happy birthday, Cookie. 28 today. <laughs> 28, going on 48. <laughs> Tinkler. Picks up Tory Thies. Thies pops it across speak, to Bidgood. Yeah, Bidgood. Bid good travelling, travelling, goes back into traffic, doesn't connect there with Thies that time, and Kiss Kibble watches it over the sideline. Yeah, advantage so. play there, I think Renee was looking for the yeah. for the call, but uh, umpire Goodsall was playing advantage, so uh, yeah, Tori. Probably she didn't, she didn't have to go back into the traffic that, the way she did, it No, I think, opened up for her, yeah, but she went no, back. Keep coming left, I think, was the option, because there's plenty of space, so the game seems to be at the moment just played on the far side of the field here um, for both teams. Again, Tory Thies has been very good. Great work down that right hand side. Pops the ball through, but just over the back line. So, Rangeville out of trouble again. Tony Cox brings the ball back for a 16. That one two with Kibble. Oh, yeah, Kibble just, 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 just yeah, makes a mistake. There's not too many of them today from Kibble. Yeah, I'm uh, just not sure whether Rangeville. Need to just, I think, mix it up a little bit now. Try something a little bit different. Um, I think it's playing into Newtown's hands here now. Um, ball movement. I think Newtown are probably content with just getting the ball into the D and it goes over the baseline and they're trying to defuse the situation. Yeah, just seems to be a one -nil holding their defensive set up here. Sam Richards again. Richards has been good. Lots of yards from Richards. Yep. Ola Rickett. Nice. But bid good, strong. Unlucky. Wins a free hit, bid good. So yeah, bid good, Cook, Feast, all been quality through the midfield for Newtown. Hanlon looks back. Back to Simone. Ebony Pansram. Great pass, Simone. Directing the ball out here as well. Tinkler does enough, gets it to Thies. Feast. Good challenge yeah, there from Rickett. And speed here with Tory. 
See what oh, we can do. In and away on Anderson. Back stick tackle. Popped up by Ali Campbell, short corner. No short corner. So Ali Campbell made that in, put that in a dangerous position and short corner. Yeah, that was just uh, benefits of nice pure speed there. Tory got out of that contest nice and quick and I think caught Rangel off guard. But we've got another short corner here for Newtown. I think this is probably about 10th in the second half. See what we can do here. Same setup. So Richards to inject. Cook on top with Bedney on the left. Got Thies right. Tinkler left. Nice and Jack Simone. The layoff to Tory Thies. Pops it in. Oh, great save there, Lily Kemp. What can't Lily Kemp she do? Saved, she saved about four shots there. Oh, outstanding work, Lily Kemp. Yeah. Just right. gives a short corner away, though. Fantastic effort by Lily. Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, I think Newtown are trying every, everything here at the moment. Might need uh, Coach Ross to pull out a special <laughs> short corner option here, I think, because Lily Kemp's saving everything at the moment. And Newtown happy for the continued short corners to lead the game. Yeah, chewing into the time in this last yeah, quarter. Just over 10 minutes to go. Here's an op a different option. Tinkler. Tinkler. Oh. oh. Just, just hit it well. Hit it too well, I think. Just through Sam Richards' yeah, legs. couldn't quite get that stick down in time, Sam, as we speak. Jenny Anderson. Just gets a touch on that, Richard. So, Jenny Anderson. Great ball. Oh, uh, yeah, Delaney Burke just on the foot. Caddy Hill on the ball. Just um, taking precious seconds off the game here now, Newtown. Simone Bettany on the ball. Should we that pass there, again? Over Burke. Burke uh, pops it through to Campbell. 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 Strong over. Yeah, good option. Delaney Burke. Good recovery by Simone. Oh, Panzerim cleans up, but stick check there from Bettany. So opportunity here now for Rangeville. Ali Ke uh, Jenny Anderson's come up on the ball. Anderson travels. Brings it back out. Just Travel for there. An option. It's a ball towards the D, turned over. Lee. Richards. Oh, Richards, Richards. Oh, she's with speed. Got some space here now, Richards, Richards but gonna unfortunately well it's just her. Oh, great running. tackle. Campbell, well read. Yep. She's got that Campbell eye. Picks the ball up. Unfortunately, Sam Richards, it was just her against four Rangel players, so. <laughs> Matty Goodman's second effort. Oh, oh great effort. Great good tackle. Re good reward for effort. Yep. Goodwin just drags yeah. it out of reach. Absolutely exhausted yeah. looking face, but Think doing well still. Yeah, a bit of exhaustion, a lot of the faces out here at the moment, Steve. And Red Lions look like they've scored their third yep. up on so field two. It's a 3 0 game now at the top field. Red Lions over Pasta in the A3 men's grand final. And here we go with Tori Thies. Speed just do? tears away. Yeah, good layoff. Puts the ball forward. Give yourself an option again, Tori. Oh, great work. Some nice hockey there. Yeah, trailing five. And Tori showing all of her skills. Good defence from Ranger, though. We've got over there Ava Campbell on the ball. Campbell good and Panzer effort, Ava, come yeah. together. Come together. Gets a foot there, Ava. It's good effort. But as we said, balls on the far side of the field again. See what happens over here now. Kibble to Beckman. Good skills there, Beckman. Try and find Chelsea Hollist. Yeah, good recovery, Chelsea. Unlucky, thought she might have had a foot there, but... Tinkler gets the ball out. Wants Tory. Tory promotes it. Just doesn't connect with the striker. Alright, just kibble on the ball. Steph Batterham, that is on the right striking line there for Newtown. Okay, that may be good. 
Be good. Pops at the batter ham. Turn over kibble. So fourth quarter, seven to go. One nil the score. Yeah. We mentioned earlier about just game management and tempo and Newtown are doing it really well here at the moment. Yeah, they're certainly in full control here at the moment. Good defence from Rangeville. They can't get a goal, but they got one early and Rangeville are really struggling to get it out, the ball out of their own half. So we transfer here from Kibble to Campbell. Campbell That's a again. good one. And yes, we've got the bit of space out here so we'll see what Matty Goodwin can do just throws that angle ball picked up by Hanlon Cook yeah looks like Olivia Winter Winter great Winter effort picks up the foot of Goodwin um, trying hard Goodwin Lisa Whiteley on the ball find Cook in the midfield a lot of space here now Let's see what Cook can do Cook has Tory overlapping at the post, it's not but the user, but the deflection comes tall. back to as a shot. Kemp sees it over the back line. So Lily Kemp, no need to touch that. Well left. Six minutes. Just a, yeah, a bit of a bit too much space in the midfield. Then Steve, um, Range will just need, if they want to stay in the game, they just need to tighten up that defence through there. Lee turns the ball over. Be good. Back to Big Good. Big Good has Tory. Like they got eye contact and Big Good wanted Tory to run, but she's done enough yeah, running for the moment. Running. <laughs> it's a good ball though. If I was Big Good, I probably might have been <laughs> looking at Tory to give me a bit more of an effort there. But saying that, it's still quite hot here. Gibble, Gibble to Cox. They've worked their way out of defence very well today. Jenny Anderson. Anderson. Oh, just. Good challenge there from Tory Thies, but Anderson up to it, gets the ball away. Mm -hmm. Bentley's happy to see it over the baseline. Yep. So range will now up in the 25, need to turn the ball over off the 16. Yeah, just looking at the clock, we've got five to go here in the fourth quarter. We'll probably need to push up here and set a press. Looks like there's a few gaps though. Yeah. Bentley. Gets the ball across to Whiteley. Well, it digs it out pressure, between the legs. Chelsea Hollis, good effort. Delaney Burke over the stick. The young guns turn the ball over. Burke, good contest around here. Bentney. Bentney. Good run from Burke. Just, yeah, just touch it over the back, back line. line. It's a huge crowd in here. Last last uh, few minutes of this A2 Women's Grand Final. Oh, unlucky there. Looks like obviously fell off Delaney Burke's stick last. Bentney to Whiteley. Whiteley again under the... Under pressure there from the range will attack. Cook. Cook's been good today too in the middle. Just throws a turnover. Again, I think Tory's very oh, run out of legs, Tory. Oh, and we've just lost yeah. a Newtown player for so Cook's gone for a couple. A couple of minutes. Four to go. We'll see what Rangel can do here now with that extra player. Might be an opportunity now for Rangel. Anderson brings the ball back out. Hempstead, great tackle in there by Thies. Thies strong. Beats one, wins the free hit. Tori Thies. Yeah, good experience there by Tori. Yeah, she might have been the difference today, mate. What are your thoughts? Yeah, I think she's uh, she's been the most potent attacking option for um, for Newtown. Um, yeah, just speed, some of that A-grade experience, I think, for Tori as well. Yeah. Um, clearly showing the benefits of that today. Three and a half. Ali Campbell bringing the ball back. Big cross oh, pass now to Kibble. Kibble. There's a bit of space on that Lots of space on the open Rangel. side. Patterson. Patterson turns. Has Tory to beat. Which has been a tough job. Good work from Richards. Good legs. Just Keeps up. going, yeah. Richards. He hasn't stopped. It's a stationary receiver. These are Tony Cox. It's a fantastic tackle. And Richards, got some play here running. now. Is that Isla Rickett on the ball? Good strength from Tony Cox. Copped a barrage of defence there. Rickett still on the ball. Oh, green card. Can't see. Oh, that's Tory Thies. So yeah, Newtown are down now yeah. with two off. Two off. So 
Huge opportunity here Great. for the next minute or so. Yeah, I think if, uh, if Rangeville are going to uh, capitalise this, now's the time. I think Tory Feast just wanted a rest. <laughs> Brenna Simmons, so Jess Kibble on the ball. What can we see here from Rangeville? Kibble strong. Richard shadowing. With some free loose Be ball. Good. Loose ball. Mm -hmm. No, that's enough. There. Wins the stick check. Kibble gives herself room. Newtown defending well. I got players around the ball. Just loose pass, unfortunately, for Rangeville. Good effort from Chelsea Hollis, so. though. Yeah, many pans ram. Just take a time here yeah, now. Slow so things down and Cook, the Captain Cook, Captain comes Cook back, onto the, back field. on the field. Any relation, Matt? Not to me. <laughs> Maybe to the captain. <laughs> Sam Richards. Oh, oh, Richards, air swing. That's probably a bit of fatigue setting in there. Oh, Sam Richards has probably session. done the most yards of anyone today. Yeah, trying to clearly get the ball down the other end of the field. Been good in this heat. Yeah. Again, very hot here today. Yeah, Rangers still have the one player advantage here. So there's space somewhere for them. Just got to find it. Layla Patterson, strong. Patterson does we well. Big, wins a free hit. Big good in there. Minute and a half. Patterson with Hempstead. Back into the contest, unfortunately. Pensram picks it up, gets a big shove from Hollist. Uh, tried hard, Chelsea, but... Pensram stands the ground. Yeah, asking. She'll find exact spot. Again, taking valuable seconds off the clock and a nice clearance down the end of the field. So that'll probably waste another 10 or 20 ten, seconds. Yeah, Tony Cox yeah, is sprinting, sprinting after there. the ball. We've got a minute to go. Great work from Tony Cox. Throws the ball back. Desperation now for Rangeville. Inside a minute, one nil down. Need to have a, another. Need to score a goal to force this into Shoot shootouts. Outs. Anderson. Jenny Anderson. She's beaten her play here, but bit good. Get back in the contest. Drives it forward. Straight to a Newtown Lee stick. Unfortunately, picks the ball. Beats Campbell. Patterson. Beats Patterson, balls heading over, over the back line. So we're inside the final 30 seconds. Yep. Tony Cox sprinting again after the ball. <coughs> Newtown back to their full complement of players. Tori Thies returning to the field. Got 15 seconds here. Yeah, and the call, oh. so that's probably the, the ball game. Yeah. yeah, I think yeah, Newtown will just take the time off here. So Tori Thies fittingly probably has the last play. Oh, great tackle, Jess, but can we get it down Good to the other end of the field with Kibble. three seconds? And that's Great the ball win game. there. And uh, congratulations, congratulations Newtown. Congratulations to Newtown women for winning 1-0 against Rainville. Field two, I believe we're going into the, third, the fourth quarter and red line lead past side 3-0. So there we have it. So the Newtown girls get up here 1-0 over Rangeville in a great A2 women's grand final. We'll be back very shortly with the A2 men's grand final against two red-hot teams, Newtown and Past Eye. See you shortly.